Greetings, special centurions, and welcome, fellow YouTubers, back to Oblivion. We are currently in the Imperial City Waterfront District, about to speak to Armand Christoph to continue the Thieves' Guild missions, having stolen the bust of the Leowin, no, Shaden Hall Countess, and used it to frame the mole who had infiltrated the Thieves' Guild. I uncovered the informant that had compromised the Thieves' Guild. Yes, you did, but you I used me, you bastard. The Lathasis bust, but I couldn't be certain that you weren't working with Mivrina. Here is the reward you were promised. Even though the bust is gone, you've earned it. Damn right, I have. I'm also promoting you to the Guild rank of Bandit, which will let you use Darji of Leowin as your fence. Yay. Good work. 100 gold. Sadly, I don't have anything for you. I only work with the less experienced guild members. You should go see Scriva in Breville from now on. You can find her at the Lonely Suitor Lodge. I wouldn't recommend bothering her at home unless the door is unlocked. Okay. I have friends visiting soon, so I told them this. Cool. Okay, so we need to go to Bruma, obviously. That's the next stop for us. Uh, not sorry, Bruma, Breville. And we haven't actually been there yet. So let's just head straight down. I want to carry on doing the Thieves Guild, so let's go. Let's go, huh? Okay, so it's night time. Four in the morning. What stage of vampirism are we at? I think we're at just the first stage, right? Yeah, okay. So what we probably want to do is wait for a moment. No, because if we, even if we wait for an hour, people will start waking up, so it's too late to wait. Let's go into the church. Well, actually, let's find the mages. Oh, everyone's going to be asleep in the mages' guild anyway. Nothing to do in Breville yet, and because we've never been here before. So we don't have any quests or anything. Let's go into the church, see if anyone's awake in the church. Oh, we need to rest. I need to sleep for an hour. I need to level up. Let's just pray, get rid of our afflictions, if we have any. We'll go to the Mages Guild, sleep for an hour to level up. How much inventory space do I have? Not very much, only 60. It's not worth picking anything up yet because we'll just overburden ourselves. Hmm, or maybe it is. We can just loot this area. Put the quill back, you ninny. Bravel Mages Guild Basement. What is down here? Looks like just food. Ooh, leather greaves. Nah, not worth picking up. The shite. Tis shite, chat. Complete shite.
nothing in the basement at all. So many tempting necks to bite chat, but it's pointless. Okay, here's a spare bed. Let's sleep for an hour. If she's still here when we wake up, if our vampirism is increased, we'll feed. Descendant to level 16. You've been trying too hard, thinking too much. Relax. Just trust your instincts. Just be yourself. Do the little things and the big things take care of themselves. Good. Three in endurance. Five in willpower. And two in strength. Yeah. We've ascended to the next level of vampire. In your dream, you see a beautiful young woman holding an infant to her breast. It is only as you draw near that you realize that the woman is a des desiccated corpse and the child is a purple and bloated dying of plague. As mother and child crumble to dust, you awaken. Damn it, I was going to eat you. Morning. Shut up, bitch. Damn it, everyone's waking up. No! No, I need to okay. feed! No! Damn it all. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Yes, go to bed, go to bed, go to bed. Nice. Nope, she woke up immediately. Fuck's sake. Oh well, it's too early like I thought. Hello, Shut up. Silver sapphire ring, nice. Yes. Don't yes me like that as if you don't know what you're doing. You know exactly what you were doing. Right, let's get the recommendation. Hello, dear associate. You're here for a recommendation, I presume. Mm -hmm. Are you prepared to earn it? Well, I've earned it everywhere else I've been, so fuck yeah. I'm afraid I haven't had time to prepare anything conventional. I'm very preoccupied with this situation concerning Ardalin. Perhaps you can help with that, however. I can't directly get involved for fear of embarrassing the poor girl. I'll need you to have a little chat with Varen Vamori, and you can learn something about the power of illusion in the process. Okay. Don't say anything to her. I don't want to embarrass her further. Once this is all taken care of, I'll speak to her privately. Martina Floria at the Arcane University has truly mastered illusion spells. You should speak with her about training further. Okay. Illusion training. Traveled. Mm-hmm. Rumors. Archmage Traven is the... F yeah, no, no rumors there. Varen Vamori. I don't understand it. Some ridiculous male thing, I suppose. He's been bothering Ardeline every day for a while now. He even stole her mage's staff. <gasps> Gasp. Perhaps he thinks it's amusing. I don't know. But it needs to stop. It's making her miserable. It's more symbolic than practical, but each carries great significance to its owner. You're going to get Arteline's staff back. Take this charm scroll. With it, you should find Varon more receptive to questioning. Don't come back without that staff. Okay. Make sure Varen hands over that staff. Okay. Any luck talk? No, I want spells. Where's everyone else? I want to buy spells while I'm here. 
Where are all the other fuckers? They better not be upstairs because they're not asleep, that's for certain. I'm Ardalin. I'm the guild. Ah, oh, they're all just fucking around up here. Alright, we'll do it in a minute. Oh, that sun, it's stinging. This grievous house is now open, so we can come in. Talk to her, question mark. Where is she? There you are, Screever. Having some breakfast, I see. The blessing of the fox upon you. Okay, so that's stealing, reading the book. You glance at it over her shoulder. Okay, nothing. Ah, you are the new thief. I am your new doyen. Nice to meet you, doyen. I have a special request from the widow of a former fence in Leowin. As your new doyen, I am asking you to help her. Okay. A street scavenger made off with a ring that the widow Adarji values highly. She is offering a reward. Mm -hmm. The guild frowns on freelance thieves. Are you willing to go to Leowin? Find the ring and get it back to Adarji? I am, yes. This is good. Go to Leowin. Speak with the Darji and help her find her ring. Okay. Sounds easy enough. Any rumors for me? I saw Kudai moping around outside the Mages Guild yesterday. In fact, I could swear she was crying. I hope she finds her missing friend. Hmm, Kudai has a missing friend. Good hunter. We just came from the Mages Guild. Okay, whilst we're in Braville, let's switch to the Braville recommendation oh. quest. Where is the... Oh, shit. The shop. Here it is. The Fair Deal. You'll always get a... Any rumors? Varen Vermori. Varen Vermori right. has a silver tongue, does he? Alright, let's charm you since I've got my vampirism. Uh, what am I doing? That. This. I don't want any waste vampire seduction on you. But I will enthralling presence you. Blammo! Well met. Yes, well met indeed. In now, buy my stuff at ridiculously high prices. We'll go with 60%. Should be good. Uh, Dwarven Battle Axe. Nice. Dwarven Bow. Dwarven dagger. Whoa, she's really selling it. She's really buying at really low prices. Elven short sword weighs 16 and does 14 damage. So we're going to keep it instead of Bruce F. Million sword. Actually, wait, that's silver. But I think Elven works like silver in that it can attack ghosts. You got a great. You've made it. Could be wrong. You got it. Maybe we should just sell it. That seems. Because we don't we, we don't want both, and I can't be bothered to go all the way up to. Um, Wayne and Priory at this point. An egg. You got a great deal there. That's a fair deal. A good. We need more healing potions, actually, so I do need to go up to... We've got a spell that does that, so we can sell that. Cold Touch can go. 
these lesser gems can go because they barely hold anything. Um, yeah, I need more healing potions, so I am going to go back to Wayne and Pryor at some point. So we'll keep the Elven Short Sword and we'll put away Brusef Amelian Sword until we have a decent soul gem or a couple of decent soul gems that we can use to recharge it. Ah! You, you're the one I'm talking to. Can I help you? Yes. Oh, he's a great, he's a thieves guild person. Yes, I sort of know her. W well, I mean... Don't lie to me, yes. motherfucker. Uh, he's uh, almost maxed already. So I just need to hit him with the rolling presents. Shapoopy! Hello, friend. Yes, I am your friend. Now talk to me about Adeline. I Ardeline. don't know what to say. All I want is for her to care about me. To feel the same way as I do about her. But she doesn't. Oh, dear. I try and I try. And it just doesn't matter. It makes me furious sometimes. Well, move on then. Give up, buddy, and move on. I've never laid a hand on her. Either in anger or... I've never hurt her, okay? What about the major stuff you stole? Any rumors as well? I don't think that Gil Gondren really wants to run Silverholm on the water. He never seems happy when he's there. Okay. All right. I admit it. I took it from her. I I don't know what I was thinking, honestly. Yeah, and then you sold it, you prick. I was trying to tell her how I feel, again, and she wouldn't even stop to talk to me. I just got so angry. I was a little ashamed afterwards, but I didn't know how to apologize or give it back. I wish I could. So you sold it instead. I'm afraid I don't have it anymore, you see. I... I sold it. You making this shit up? Mine, you... Saurus Aranum. Are you gaslighting me right now? There's no way you're gaslighting me right now. If I still had it, I'd glad. He lives in the Talos Plaza district of the Imperial City. He's the one who has Ardalene's staff now. Uh, okay. Tell Ardalene I'm sorry. Whoops, didn't mean to hit him with that. Uh, what am I doing? Three, this. Carandiel, mage trained, scholar by inclination, student of our Aldmeri ancestors, the Aeliads. Hmm, you know anything about statues? I can't believe a Mage's Guild associate was found dead in Chadenhall. What kind of a place are they running there? Yeah, well, Falco's a dick, what can I say? You too. Anyone? Hello, Who's could I? You Any are. Any luck talking with Varen Vermori yet? It should be no trouble at all once you use that scroll. Mm-hmm. Varon Vamori should give it to you once you've purchased it. Yeah, I have, for fuck's sake, Varon Vamori. He sold it, huh? Well, this just keeps getting worse. Very well. I presume he gave you some indication of where the staff is now located. Take these and go resolve the situation. Yeah, no worries. And of course, please keep this just between us. Yeah, while we're keeping things just between us. I heard you were crying recently. Does that have... No? Doesn't care. Get that staff back, associate. What can I do for you? You can sell me some magic. Some say that Traven is miss... Fuck's sake. Good day. Is it too early or something? Yeah, it's 8 o'clock. They don't start selling till 9. Well, let's go look for some other rumors while we wait for them to start selling spells. Ha! Shelling spells. What can I do? No rumors. A warlock's luck, eh? You got anything for me? Take a chance. I'm <laughs> <laughs> Sound like Beavis Just and Butthead. <laughs> you may have heard of me. <laughs> oh good, he sells spells. 
May I interest you in some of my fine wares? Not very good ones, though. Nope, terrible ones. Let's do business. Oh, Ring of Transmutation. Fortify Magicka, 50 points on self, but drain strength and endurance. No, thank you. I don't know why I'm looking through this garbage. I want rumors. Have you heard? Someone desecrated the tomb of Lathasa. No wonder her ghost haunts that place. Yeah, that was me. Can you believe it? I did that. You oh. Fighters Guild. Let's see if there's anything we can pinch and sell. We don't have many repair hammers. We need some more. Where are all the repair hammers at? Not much in here. I was hoping for some silver somewhere. Silver weapons or something at least, but see la vie. See you later, assholes. Gonna go sell everything now at this place. The fair deal. You're always please sixty eight. Bye. Poopy. Good day. Only quality goods for sale. You can probably get up to sixty-five because she's selling. She's buying super cheap already, anyway. Yeah. An ex. A fine. You got it. You've made. Fine transaction. Just stacking up that gold chat, stacking up them dollars. We don't need beguile, we can chart, we've got magic that can do that. No, I want the headless I want the headless zombie. Oh we've got Come 14 back. repair hammers, that's not bad. Bye! Bye.
Forlorn Watchman, eh? Right, they should be selling spells at this point. To what do we Greetings, Well met. Forlorn I Watchman. don't know much about that ghost, but some say he died in a horrible shipwreck. I would stay away from him if I were you. Bad omen. Mm, okay. Each night he wanders the shore of Nibbon Bay. Then he stops and looks mournfully out to sea. I if can you're see. Interested, you may want to see Gilgondron at Silverholm on the water. When it comes to local legends, he's the best source in town. Okay, I will do that. I can see why What's His Face is obsessed with you. You're pretty damn fit, actually, for an elf. Uh, rumors? Any rumors? I don't know what Archmage trade. Nope. Do you have? Could a? Yes, I'm the one looking for my friend. His name is Henantir. If you find him, I'll be glad to offer you a sizable reward. Okay, Henantir. I miss him so. We were study mates at the Arcane University, and we've come to grow fond of each other over the years. He's always getting himself into jams with the careless ways he performs his experiments. And, well, I'm afraid he's done it again. I'm going to level with you as you seem like you wish to help. Henandir isn't missing. On the contrary, I know exactly where he is. The problem is he's trapped and there's no way I can free him. Oh, dear. Fine by me, I just want the reward. Great. Whatever suits you and gets me Henantir back suits me just fine. When you're ready to go and see him, let me know. But please, do hurry. Ah, oh, through a nightmare darkly. That's really, really horrible mission. Do you have... Get that what can I... Why is it none of you are selling spells yet? Delphin Gend. Creator of the celebrated Enemies Explode spell. Advi oh, she does. I heard that one of the Skingrad mages was assaulted, but I don't know the details. Do you? Was he? Okay. Have a look around. Alluring gaze, beguiling towing. touch. Enemies explode. Meh, it's not that good. Flash bolts. Frenzy, heroic touch, heroism. And t oh, heroism is target, that's why. Illuminate, inspiration. Mesmerizing grasp. Moonlight. Pacification. Seductive charm. Yeah, nothing there that we want to buy. Farewell. What about you? What can I do for you? Sell me spells. Damn it, why is only one person selling spells here? I thought this was supposed to be the Mages Guild. Is everything all right? Shut up. Okay, so who am I going to talk to about the Forlorn Watchman? This guy over here. Okie dokie. Silver horn on the water. Gilgondrin. Silver home on the water has beds and food. What's your pleasure? Pussy. Pussy is my pleasure. Where's all the women? The watchman looks like he may have been a sailor. No one knows where he came from or why he looks so sad. I don't like talking about the dead like they're some kind of tourist attraction. But that spirit has been making his ghostly journey for years now. We've learned to just accept that he's there. Every night, short as clockwork, he appears at Bon Watch Camp at 8 on the shore of Nibbon Bay. He's never harmed anyone, but most people give him a wide berth. You seem curious enough, so I'll be glad to pinpoint where he appears on your map. Thank you. Okay, thank you. What's going on with you? I ran into some goblins in the woods not long ago. Nasty little beasts. Horrid beasts. I hate... Good day. Enough talk. What can I do? 
Any rumors? Have you heard about that ghost of the old man that looks out into Nib? Yeah, that's the only thing other thing I can talk to you about. Brokeel Grow Shotter, Lord High Warden of the Taps. Gilgondoran's most prized customer. I taste everything over and over and over again. So you're a drunkard is what you're telling me. I love it. Welcome. Eden Hello. Rhiannis knows more about the geography of Tamriel than anyone I've ever met. Apparently. Nope, nothing. Goodbye. Bye. Ah. Full on watchman through Nightmare Darkly. Imperial City. Lay win. Imperial City, Larkin University. Unfriendly. Yes, yeah, so that's everything. I thought there was another mission around here. Something to do with someone's husband being in debt. Is it your husband? You wear the shadows well. No, nope, you're a bloke. Any Nern route down there? Can't see any. I'm so hung. Rumors. I can't make up my mind about the profit in Anvil. Oh, you're useless. No money for you. Ooh, Nern route. That's a Nern route. Yay, we finally got 20 Nern route chat. I can go and drop it off. Any down here? No. What about you, guard? You got anything useful for me? Morning, sir. No calling me sir. Interesting. Okay, well, we can't go anywhere because it's daytime and uh, we've now reached the second level of vampirism, so we can't fast travel. Who's this? Lonely Suitor Lodge. Anything going on in here? I'm Brogram Grogalash, your host at the Lonely Suitor Lodge. It may not look like much outside, but that's just the weathered Braville. Oh yeah, and how do you explain how much it doesn't look like much on the inside? <laughs> Varen Vamori can be really charming. Varen Vamori, yeah. Uh, go ahead, please. Who are you, Jeter? You look like you're stacked. Take it. Ranaline. I cook at the low. Any rumors? I saw Kudai moping around outside the Mages Guild, yes. Yeah. You. You too. Well met. Who are you, Norador? Nordino. Any rumors? Have you heard? Some. Yeah, that was me. Bye. I haven't heard. I've witnessed, though. Anything in here? There might be some magic items to buy. Let's have a look. The archer's paradox. Because a perfect arrow flies forever, and that's impossible. I'm Damien, and I have no perfect arrow. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> what have is a look around. Bow of Infliction? Better prices in all Tamriel. Oh, that's a really good archer bow. Like, archer fight bow. Firstly, it does a shitload of damage. It does more like 50% more damage than an elven bow. Then it damages their agility and their marksman capabilities, so they do less damage to you. So that's a really good bow to have in like a marksman contest. I'm not going to buy it because I don't care that much about marksman contests, but whatever. Vas ever. Uh, and what's over here? House for sale, okay. I'm Vera Leris, Captain. Any rumors for me? No. Nope. Let's go to the church. Wait, whose house is this? Henentir. Henentir, isn't that the person who's missing? Carandil's house. 
Huh. Chest. My chest. Gold. Nothing in it. Just gold. Just a gold. Alaren Locks House. What are you guys up to? Why? Drinking. Captain Lex blames the Grey Fox for stealing the tax collection. Yeah, I did that as well. Everyone knows my stories. What? What's going on? Nothing, really? Okay. I give up. I give up. There's officially no one in town giving me any decent what? rumors. All we've got is this forlorn watchman to go on. Who's where exactly? He's out there, but that's 8 o'clock, so... That's in eight hours. We could make our way round to there, I suppose, and it would be about three or four hours before he showed up. Depending on what we have to fight, because we have to come out and go round here and round here. That could be about five or six hours. So I suggest we go do that. Since there's nothing else to do, we can keep an eye out for Nernroot. Please be gentle. Yeah, tell me about any rumors you know of. State your business. I saw Kudai move. You dicks. Alright, fuck you very much. Is that a horse? No, it's a horse to steal. It's not our horsey, it's a dead horse. It's a stoley horsey. What is it, sir? No rumors. You and If you rumors? are looking to buy a... No, I'm looking for rumors. I think all Bogram Gro Galash cares about is the lonely... Good to know. I don't want to discover this ruin up on the right because it's another ruin that we don't have to explore and I don't want to do that yet. Let's come out over this way and look for Nernroot. <gasps> Nernroot! I see Nernroot over there. Hurcha! Now how do I get out is the only question. I have to swim out. Can we get up here? Yeah, nice. Owie. No known route around there. Yeah, we have to wait until... Oh, more known route. Nice. We have to wait until night time before we can fast travel anywhere. So let's just go and travel long, normal travel. Slow travel. Walk travel to uh, where this ghost supposedly is and see what he wants. I just saw fire up ahead. What was that? Or not? Oh, yeah. It's a bandit bowman and a spriggan on the road. We need to, The bandit bowman's going to die to the bear easily. So we need to fight the spriggan. Told you. Where are you going? Come back. Spriggans are nasty. And they're even nastier when they summon bears to fight you. Luckily it's cloudy and raining at the moment, so the sun's not too strong. Which means we're not losing too many hit points. If it was super bright and sunny in the afternoon, which it... Uh, yeah, if it was super bright and sunny this afternoon, then we'd be in a real pickle. There goes the bear.
stupid thing is, this thing still has a heal. It's going to heal any second now. We need to start healing ourselves or we're going to die. Uh, let's immobilize the sprig and then take it out that way. How much magic do we have overall? 269. So we've got two immobilizing, two paralysis spells, and then we run out. Let's just get full mana, and then we'll... Um, Jump down, paralyze her, and go. No, you don't. I'm not letting her heal. Look at that ass chat. Look at the ass on her. Oh shit, she fucked us anyway. <laughs> that one attack she got off killed us. Let's try again. Oh, I should have saved it before jumping down. That one attack she got off us took half our health off and then drained us of all the rest of our health. Should we get some archery going while we wait for our magic to... Um, uh, iron arrow, steel bow... Die, Spriggan. I'm going to go check over there because there's bound to be some Nern root over there. Bound to be some Nern root over here somewhere. Like behind this rock. Well, not. Okay. No Nern root here, chat. No Nern root here. Swim through the middle of the lake because there'll be known roots somewhere. No known root up there. Really, there's no known root anywhere around here. You're kidding me. You're absolutely happy. Oh, there it is. There's some. Okay. And we need to repair hammer. There's a bear there. How far away is this place we're going to? And what time is it? 4.20. If we, we attract the attention of the bear, the bear will come after us all the way over to that point. 
So let's come up and round, sneak round the bear. Hope there was no Nern route down there that we missed. There's some more. Get it, zombie. Teach that mud crab a lesson. Oh, instantly pones it. Right, again, I don't want to find this ruin here. Otherwise, I'll have to explore it. So it looks like we're going over there where that tree is. So I'm just going to swim straight over to it. Okay, taking care to go round the ruin so that we don't trigger discovering that ruin. And watch camp. This is it. Oh, treasure chest. Strong potion of healing. Nice. Any nern root around here? What's this? Literally just a bed. Okay. What's that over there? It's a crab. Another one, another mud crab. Nice. Lots of Nern root chat, Nern root everywhere. Okay, it's now 6 p.m. The ghost is supposed to appear at 8. Is that right? 8 o'clock, yeah. So he should appear here in about two hours. It's not perfect timing, but it's pretty good. Let's just go across here and see if there's anything over here worth having. See if there's any Nern root. down here. There's an imp over there. I don't want to attract it. I also don't want to discover the ruin. There's some down root behind that rock. Man, we found a lot of it. How much do we have now? 26. Nice. Right, let's see what this ghost wants. now dark enough that we can wait an hour. If we wait, our vampirism will go up though, so I don't think it's worth doing. I think what I'll do, guys, is I'll end the episode here, since we're only a couple of minutes away from me ending the episode anyway. And then I'll just simply let the time tick down while I stand here casting spells. 
until the ghost appears. When the ghost appears, I'll then restart the, the episode. Well, I'll start the next episode and uh, we'll go from there. But guys, thanks so much for hanging out today. I hugely appreciate it. Uh, I hope you're really enjoying the series as much as I'm enjoying playing. I'm going to be back tomorrow morning with another episode of Oblivion. So hopefully I'll see you all there for that. If not, I'll try and catch you in some other content I produce. I try and make content every single day now. So, sal wait till next time.